Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Ni Hamuda. In this tutorial, we're going to create the this birthday design in a couple of minutes. If you are new, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you get notified whenever I post tutorial like this. And if you are a whole subscriber, you are welcome back now without further ado let's jump right into it so i'll quickly remove all the stuff everything removed okay so that i'm gonna start from scratch Leaving these two guys, and background color for default is black. Okay, so we're going to start afresh now. So for this design, I decided to pick my color from the picture that I was sent. So I'm going to go over here. Where I'm going to get the picture for use in this design so I should see that on the whatsapp business okay this is it so this is a particular one that I used this right here all right so this is it so this is what we we'll do increase little and place it at this top corner okay now to get our background this is the color for our background okay so I'm using a gradient Grant picking two colors this which can be anyone here which is this I pick the color from here this and then the lighter shade of it I picked it from here okay so this is a color all right that's for the background now let's Fade the background into the image. We'll get a boss square and then we'll go to color. We'll make the color. Sorry, go to gradient. Choose a black and a white gradient. Sorry, so let's say black. And then come over here and choose a white. So black and white now, like this. Now duplicate it, duplicate and then mesh them together, mesh both shapes together and then go over to where you have erase color, enable it, increase the tolerance, ok, go to color, choose the color that you want to use, go to gradient, pick the background color, and then then begin to stretch so this is one then copy and turn it like this right here alright so this is it okay so the next thing we want to do is to get our test. Okay, it's going to be print them out straight to the point. Okay, this is Queen. We'll go over to font. The font we use is 
Asanika Demi Bond. Okay, go ahead and pick the color of the chair she's sitting on, and it's darkening it a little. Okay. stuff like that um, I'll go ahead and get the, the crown which I would get from me okay so I'll go as a photo because I have moved the back one so go to photo room and get the crown yeah so go to color enable it choose the color of the text and let the crown be sorry let the crown be on top of the e double e in the queen yeah Right, then let's get the birthday text today is a special day in your life make all your acts desire Just a simple text. Go and get a particular family. This right here. And then for the happy birthday, make it both for emphasis. Alright, so let the text be this, but let it be darker. Alright, like sand color. Increase test space line spacing. All right, this is it. Okay. Now create a border around the text. First, reduce the fill. The opacity to zero. Come over here and choose a color, and then the stroke should be one. And then OK. Right. So let's get other elements, which are those three right there. You would see in the next in a in a video I have made how I was able to make this blow. Now we've gotten it, so just put it right there and change the color. Go to color filters and change the color. Alright, I think this is it. Copy and let's sound. Um, now put some around here. Okay, okay, the next one doesn't have any blur effect. That we can also go back to color filter and change the color. Then we can 
put right there. Okay. So that is that. Alright, so go over to change, get the circle. Let it be the same color with the text color. Alright. Yes, Add outline to it. White. Then this right here you should spell your main. Change the color to white and this should be from the paint. Color should be the test should be vertical and the color of course should be white. For this, we can even change the color to something light, not exactly white, but something like white. This right here, close to it. So let's adjust this. save as image then we can do a little retouch with um, snap snap seed okay so we have saved successfully it's time to go to snap seed and retouch the image a little all right so go by here go over here and then we'll increase the details So congratulations, we are done with the design. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so that you get notified when my post tutorial like this. I remain your very coach, Lee Amuda. See you in the next tutorial. Please drop a comment 